One in three women experience physical or sexual violence, according to the United Nations. Nearly half of all women killed in 2012 died at the hands of a partner or family member. The 25th of November is the International Day to End Violence Against Women. The United Nations began the commemoration on Monday evening. Its headquarters and the Empire State Building in New York were lit up in orange, the colour that the UN has chosen to symbolise the commitment to end violence. Pumzili Umlambo Nguka, executive director of UN Women, said on Tuesday that the orange light shines on violence against women at home, in schools, in villages and cities in all nations. No country, no culture, no woman, young or old, is immune to this human rights violation. And very often, the perpetrators go unpunished. Secretary General Ban Ki-moon called violence against women and girls a global pandemic. He said it's up to both women and men to bring it to an end. Let us commit ourselves together starting from today and all the year round, to put an end uh, to this uh, global uh, disgrace.